here's a tutorial on how to use the map shot function in XMind. Now, I want to make sure you're aware of this before we go ahead. You have to have one of the paid versions of XMind. It has to be XMind Plus, XMind Pro, or an XMind subscription. What X, the map shot lets you do is it lets you take a picture of whatever you select. It's really simple to use. You can either hit F7 or you can use the tools and then map shot. So into tools, uh, map shot, and you're good to go. So I'll go ahead and I'm going to hit F7. It's gonna, you can see now my cursor has changed into a little cross. I'm going to go ahead and I'll choose wherever I want to go from. And I'm going to highlight that, make sure I get just enough of everything. I don't want to get all this, so I can go in after and I can still fix the sizing until I get what I like. Now, some people go, okay, I've got to this point, what do I do next? The secret is to double click, double left click in the light area, anywhere in here, and you're good to go. Double click, and it's been saved. It's telling me exactly where it is on my desktop. Now, the next thing I can do, you can see the arrow is still there, the cross is still there. I can keep going and I can do more if I want to. Otherwise, if I don't want to, go ahead and hit Escape, and you're done. If you want to go ahead and check out your image, you can just click on the link up ahead, or you can delete, or you can hit the X button to get rid of it, but you can click on it. It'll call up for us, and we can see exactly what, the, what we took an image of. There you go. There's your map shot. If you found this video useful, get the cheat sheet. It's an XMind workbook filled with tutorials, videos, and links, and all sorts of cool stuff. Imagine that, using XMind to help you use XMind. You can get it by following the link below. All I ask in exchange is that you give my newsletter a chance. Thanks for watching.